Probably we can do it faster, a little faster. Okay. Just a little bit. Yeah. Is something that gives me a particular pleasure. He's such a talented pianist. He can bring such beautiful colors and energy to the music. He can make great music and he can play wonderfully. He can write music as well. I was first introduced to him through Paquito de Rivera. He says, you know what, I have this fantastic composer, I think you guys should play together. That's how actually we started playing. The chemistry was obvious right away, and I think that inspired us. We needed to keep on playing. It feels better. Yes. Should, should we do I like that whole second section? Let, let, let's do it. Yeah. It's almost a challenge. It's scary because there's so much more space, there. you're so much more exposed. You have the sensation of being like naked. But at the same time, you can express yourself a lot more. When I was 14, I had a teacher in Buenos Aires who was always encouraging me to listen to composers which use their native language. I always loved a lot of different types of music and I wanted to incorporate that into what I was doing with my instrument. By the end of it, we're playing the same rhythm together. I see. And then that creates that rhythmic tension that gets released at the end of the next session. Good. To try to play music which never existed before. It's very much a reflection of our modern world. From the very first moment, I felt that we were in the same page and we breathed the same way. I can just completely let go and know that he's going to be there with me and we're going to make it, whether we play it at a ridiculous tempo. We don't really play any piece the same way twice. We have such a great time playing together and it feels so natural. Thank you.